And a terrifying scene outside of Western Washington High School. Two students shot and injured, forcing several schools into lockdown. Good evening and welcome to KXLY4 Nightside. I'm Annie Bishop in for Aaron Luna. We have just learned that one suspect is now in custody, but the Pierce County Sheriff's deputies say they're looking for two more suspects described as black males. The shooting happening about 45 miles south of Seattle outside the Graham Caponson High School. Nightside reporter Kyle Simchuk is live in the studio with an update tonight. And Kyle, any word on the condition of those students tonight? Well, yeah, Andy, the Pierce County Sheriff's Office says they are both expected to survive following surgery at a Tacoma hospital. Now, this afternoon, some incredibly tense hours for students, staff, and parents left wondering if their child was in danger. That shooting happened just after 2.30 this afternoon after outside the Graham Kaposin High School. The two male students shot, ran back to campus for help. One was found in the school parking lot, the other in a locker room. Both were rushed to Tacoma General Hospital and underwent surgery. Now, from the air, our sister station Como captured the dramatic scene as Pierce County Sheriff's deputies patted down students and searched backpacks before releasing them. Many parents rushed to the school once they heard what was going on. One received a chilling phone call from inside the school. He called me. It was whispering. Was trying to find out. I was like, talk to me. What's going on? Uh, Couldn't find out uh, they was on lockdown and he, he let uh, the teacher talk to me. So she said that uh, we didn't know what was going on, so she had locked the doors. So again tonight, one suspect is in custody, but police are still searching for two more uh, described as black males they believe are connected. Sheriff's deputies say today's shooting could be gang related. Live in studio, Kyle Simchuk, KXLY4 News.